Hello my pinkies and welcome back to another plan with me video. So I feel like when I was filming this video, I was all over the places. I don't know why, but you could tell I'm kind of scattered a bit, um, trying to reorganize myself. I think it was pretty late on a Sunday night when I filmed this, so I think that's why it's everywhere. The kit we're using for this plan with me is by XOXO Glitter and Glam. You guys must be thinking like, why am I using Halloween? Well, let me tell you, this whole month is all about Halloween because I cannot just put Halloween on one week. It's going to be four weeks of Halloween spread because I have a lot of Halloween stickers and I love holidays and Halloween is one of my favorite holiday. And not to mention that October is my birthday month and that week is also going to be a Halloween spread too. As you can see here, this is an Erin Condren kit. I got this kit in glossy and it's all silver foiled. And those are the washi that I pulled out to use for this kit right here. Let's get started. Here you will see my monthly view and also last week's plan with me. And both videos are up already. This week we're planning from the 1st to the 7th of October. With any new kits from any shop I haven't tried, I usually would look through all the sheets to see what's there and what to do first. So these do have date covers with date dots, which I love by the way, the date darts are actually on clear stickers. So it makes your artwork, the artwork shine through, which is really good. Here I have to cover the asterisk cause it's the wrong color and it bothers me all the time. For the asterisks on the left, I decide to use blanket planners, page flags. Next, I'm going to play with the bottom washi. The bottom washi is a little bit short from the actual planner, which is good because I could just add my own washi, and I always love layering my washies. And now on to my full boxes. With my full boxes, I like to put my quotes on Thursday middle section and then just play around from there. Usually my weekend boxes will be two similar ones that are I like so I could pair them together and I like to put a frame around my full boxes so I'll be adding some decorative washi to the top and to the bottom of the full boxes. Once I have my full box pattern down, I add my meal plan stickers. Once I have all my meal plan stickers down, I like to block that section off with another type of washi. As you can see here, it kind of looks like it's a black washi, but this is our secret washi. As you can see, there's our bow. Then we add our to-dos. Underneath the to-do headers, I like to add a checkbox. Reason why I prefer checkboxes over page flags is that I like to cover the dividers because of the scatter planning that I'm doing right now. Um, the dividers might show on the planner itself, so it's just easier to cover it up. going to quickly work on the weekend. It's going to be a pretty busy week and weekend for us here. Once I'm done the weekend, I will do the sidebar just to build my sidebar. What I usually put my sidebar on my Instagram and some notes or make it decorative, but mostly that's where my Instagram goes. And finally, the weekend banner. I'm sorry if it's kind of out of frame right now. 
it's usually when I plan I'm so in focus into planning and not to looking up in the camera to see if I'm in frame shot or not but what I like to do with new kits is that I like to use up all the flags in the sticker kit because this is the only time I'll be using the kit I might as well use up all the stickers or the washies or anything just to make up the flags and if there's any um, space left I would just use my washi but there's more than enough stickers here and because the weekend or the hello weekend is a script sticker and it doesn't come in a band I decided to put it at the bottom instead of the top because I felt that if I place it on top it'll be lost and you don't really see it so I'm just gonna place it at the bottom and it works very well there next and lastly I'm gonna fill in my events or the things that's going to happen that in my today's I guess you could say and I felt that the silver washi was a bit too overbearing so I'm just going to cover it slash layer it you know me with layering washi um, with some of the pink bow washies and this is how it looks before the ink so I'm just setting it up here right now to take a pretty picture <laughs> for the Instagram but yes this is how it looks before the pen I'm gonna take it out of camera fill it out and come back with it all filled in and there you go this is my week so far for the week of October 1st to the 7th it's going to be a super busy week because we are traveling so I wish you guys a happy long weekend because I believe it's Columbus Day in the US and it's a Thanksgiving weekend this weekend too for Canada. So I wish you guys a safe, happy long weekend and I will see you in my next video. Happy planning. Bye.